Hello, I'm Damien, and I'm Damien, and it's Hand of Fate, that one game. It feels like I've been playing so forever. <laughs> yes. Uh, I feel like I've learned quite a bit, actually. Uh, we'll see if we can actually put it into action tonight. Until now, I have shown compassion. That's you a big fat lie. Test me no further. Verifying this Kraken on these right, right, we gotta fight the Kraken. We'll eventually get rid of that one. The DLR, Mysterious Parchment. Uh, Mysterious Parchment costs a lot of money. I was, about, I was about to say I don't recall that one, but that's because we haven't done it yet. It works. Uh, everything's probably still fine, whatever. So in fact, I was looking at the achievements and there's like five levels of Blood Auction. It's dumb. But it's okay, because we're going to beat the game, and then I can stop playing it. Oh, good. My movement ah, speed lowers that based on money. Favorites. Traveling healer. Q. This can only end one way. Fortitude breath. An awesome shield to start with. Uh, good job. I doesn't matter. Pick up money. Immediately slow down. Trading post. Decline. Get an equipment card. A new one. Time heals. During combat, oh, press right bumper to twist time to turn your. Oh. Oh. And that has three uses. That. So if we can get to the end of the game without losing that. Um. That'll be extra helpful. Meh. Of course it's the end. Uh, so we're gonna get into one fight. Because we are indeed gonna jump backwards. Because an expedition. Press we're we're gonna be real slow during the fight with the Dead King's Hall. So hopefully it'll be not too bad of enemies. Oop. Because of course we are going to attempt the treasure chest. Because I always attempt the treasure chest and fail. Choose from these that options. That one. Not quite. I hear a click. Oh no, gas. That one. Success! We approach the trap, the, not the trap, the chest in and of itself. And with this, we attempt to open it. There we go. And we receive yet more money. I'm sure you're grateful for that. Eh, well, of course we're going to have to take the rat cleaver. We finally got the rat cleaver again. Sure, that's the right approach. Uh, extra slowdown and no money at all. Alrighty, Dead King Hall. What are we fighting? Potentially fighting for hell rats and a lava golem. That's fine. That's a failure. We have to fight both. Okay. I'm not sure the hell rats actually count as rats. So we're just going to be super slow in this fight. Oh yeah, look at this chunk along. Okay, that's two on the rats. Three on the rats. Nope, nope, nope. Try to dodge. Didn't work. One on the rats. One on the golem. Two on the rats. Three on the rats. Which means this rat's going to... Uh, next rat attack is going to be unblockable. Yep, there it is. One. Two. about to say, well, and by about to say, I mean I was being quiet because I was trying to concentrate, but uh, with it being down to the, just the golem, uh, you know, just golem is really easy for me to deal with, generally speaking. We gain 50 health, okay, no damage at all, then. If you gain health, then Food, I work hard good. to take it. Uh, 
the max health. Awesome. That's less useful. And more food. Sure. That's fine. And now that we're at the Traveling Healer, we can spend our money to get rid of this uh, slowdown curse. And by doing so, I have left m less money. <laughs> I have enough money taken away that it wouldn't matter either way. Great. Now if we can just find Hearn's antlers. Boing. No, I don't want the traveling either again. Pass it by, pass it by, pass it by. No, we're going this way to the forest exit. There we go. Work your way through the woods and see what lies Alrighty, beyond. Hungry blades. When a weapon ability is used, I consume one food. Not really a concern. It has finally come to this. Uh, mysterious parchment. I'm tired. It has been too long. Yet life. Life will not let the candle be snuffed. Uh, yeah, well. I want to know what lies beyond that. Yet, I will not go easily. So what you're telling me is you are desperate for me to kill you, and yet you won't let me kill you. Got it. Anyway, his own candle is pretty low. Gonna wear out soon. In a far-flung village, you stumble across a small church of the old gods. A monk named Petward is all like, Hey, by the way, um, if you give me a lot of money, I can totally translate your parchment. That's a shop, that's a shop, that's a shop. We will just pass it by for the moment because treasure, Embertown hero. You come across an injured adventurer whose battered and bloodied armor tells you he's seen combat recently. Sure, what's your trouble? He saw my artifact and is like, I've always wanted that! He yells and lunges forward, so I fight him off. He's going to take my artifact, isn't he? Not a huge success, but... You fight him off and he runs away. At least I maintain my artifact. Because that's a really good one that I want to hold on to. I meant to actually go in and check for Hearn's horns. Well, maybe it won't matter. We go up there. Up there is a thing we don't care about. Because it's probably going to cover over. Yep, that one, which means that right there is the end. So we can more easily go to the shop and check for Hearn's Horns. Technically speaking, we could just keep bouncing in and out of the shop until we find Hearn's Horns, but that's a, a lot of food being used up. Uh -huh. That's not the hag wraps. They are tempting, but no. Um, with every game card I get things also tempting, but no. <clears throat> All I cared about was Hearn's Horns. That's fine. Alrighty. And we go here, and then we go here. Cracks in the mud, and a cave escape. All Through the cave we go. Terrible things live in caves. Are you sure? Cursed luck. The difficulty of picking a success card, successful chance card increases. Meh. Traveling Tinkerer it would be so might easy have to create a game that merely defeats you. Maybe? A game in which you stand no chance, also completely unfair. That is not how I work. I refuse to play in such a manner. Uh, Our game is fair. And you bleed. will be defeated. But I have the Rat Cleaver, so I don't care. This would upgrade my medium armor to heavy. Hmm. No, not worth it. Alrighty, we continue up. Oh no, an ambush. Every game must include. We have been ambushed by eyes. three bandits and four hellhounds. It is the human on the other side of the table. Sometimes the draw of a card or the roll of a dice. Without it, the game is nothing but a computing machine. One rat. Still on the 
rat. Three on the rat. One on the rat. Two on the rat. Three on the rat. Sneep and kill, I guess. A choice. Select your desire. Okay. I kind of lost track of where the, the big bad was. But we got 10 food. And 20 gold. And 10 gold. Okay. Twisted Canyon. You know, I'm not going to climb down because we have Rat Cleaver. Who would have guessed that this is where the end was? Kraken Carnival. So tempting, but no, we'll just go down. The river. Uh, we can't kill. It's not very fun. Uh, call for pieces over there, though. I was left these simple pieces, and from uh, them I have built a palace of memories. A why, devilish maze. craps? Why? You will ever reach the end. Of Okay. One jump, jump, ow, of course. Dodge. 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 Ow. Dodge. 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 Almost. <laughs> Not the worst. We almost did it. Alrighty. Wake up next morning. Nothing going on. More devilish traps? No, the meat. Hello. I'd like a longer life. Ooh, two max health cards. We gain ten max health. And five. Cool, 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 cool. The elders of our kind often say we must retread paths we once took in order to gain an advantage on the present. Farewell, mortal. And we go to call the priest. Yes, hello. You have a thing I want, which is to the tune of please remove my weak ankles. I'm going to get rid of that one, too. Yeah, we might as well get rid of that one, too. Hearn's Horns, I believe, cost 20 to 24. I mean, which isn't to say it wouldn't be nice to get more. Uh, the Apprentice. Guess what, fella? I'm going to ignore you. There's the devilish traps. Uh, you know, like, you know, your fancy armor and stuff would be nice too, but oh god, this one. Somehow we did that, and I don't think we we, we got hit by one arrow. I think. Yay! And there's the exit, as I expected. <laughs> There's the third devilish traps. Okay, we don't have to worry about devilish traps anymore. Hit your ride, hit your ride, hit your ride. Suddenly. Oh no! Whenever the player is healed, they lose one coin for every two health points healed. Okay. We can we can get rid of that. We are all merely pieces upon the board. The circle repeats without end. Does the rook understand uh, the oblivion of the decline your offer when it is placed back in the box? Does the king so you're understand gonna curse me that again, aren't you? Yep. Over nothing? That's fine. Mostly I'm just trying to get here to this shop. As we get into a fight. Okay, just two bandits, that's fine. I feel sorry for you guys, honestly. Uh, 
Sail away, sail away, sail away. Alrighty, we approach the shop and hope to find Antlered Helmet. Because if we can find Antlered Helmet, I really don't care if we uh, lose all of our money every time we heal. That's not the Antlered Helmet. Okay, well, Immovable Object, a good thing to get as well, but uh, more than that... A hit on the player gives the player's next attack bonus damage. Well... Revenge is the sweetest satisfaction, don't you find? With a lack of antlers, you know, why not? But also, why not also visit this shop? Sail away, sail away, sail away. The Trader's Ring, the Inferno Potion, the Plunderer's Ring, and Warcry. Inferno Potion would be good if we didn't have the uh, thing we already have. Uh, whenever I draw it, right, whenever I draw a game card, do things. Yeah, that's fine. And by that's fine, I mean, I'm not gonna worry about that. Because the reason we went to that shop in the first place was, you know, just to get maybe one more attempt at uh, finding. Man, another ambush? Fuck you guys. Yeah, another attempt at maybe finding the helmet. Die. Die getting hit by that trap. Or we'll just kill with my shield, I guess. There's an achievement for, you know, knocking someone into a trap and then killing them. So it's like, well, yeah, maybe we can make that attempt at least. Yes, hello. Did you get Hearn's antlers in while I was gone? No, you got the scavenger's cap and thunderstrike. I mean, innocence is cool, but okay. I mean, to that extent, thunder, you know, thunderstrike is cool too. But considering, you know, my biggest issues are uh, rats and, and lizards. All right, here we go. Cave rescue. Uh, sure, attack the pirates because I don't know what trying to negotiate them with them will do. Come on, guys. Okay, King dead as well. 
lost some health, but not the worst. And we're going to get some gain cards, so... Three of them. And armory. Um... None of that is Hearn's helmet. Mask of Extortion might be cool. Uh, we will not equip it at the moment, but we'll take it. Pay for in take it. Don't equip it. Ask. Money. Food. I'm sure you are grateful for that. Marketplace. Um, I don't think we actually need to worry about anything, so let's just keep all of our food and move on. Holy Forge. Did we actually pick up the metal? Nope, did not. And the exit, like I expected. Fighter, escape, escape, escape. But we have to fight lizards and lizards to go down the ladder. What fun. Here we go. Ow. I keep getting hit by that because I keep I keep seeing the thing just a little too late. Alright, I like that one. Oh god, let's uh, use one of those. Because I am doing terrible at this for some reason. I think largely it's due to the fact that there's six enemies with shields in a rather narrow hallway. Yes, it is entirely a forest hall. Yeah, that lizard dead. Considering even after we used that thing, we took another 20 or so damage, it's probably good that we used it. Much as I wanted all three for the end. Doesn't help when we're not going to reach the end, you know? Trader's Ring, sure. Hardly a unique item, this one. Uh, Every Hearn's trader has one to aid them on long journeys. Whenever I, I gain a new curse. long and hard to make that particularly painful. Ingenious, don't you? Well, I think you I'm going to be fully healed real easy. Life. Of course, as much as I just grabbed Hearn's Antlers, uh, on the other hand... Okay, what are my current curses? Twice the failure, doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because we're about to reach the final boss. Uh, whenever I'm healed, I lose money. And whenever I get a new curse... Can I get rid of this one? Because it feels weird to hold on to. I'm just trying to think. Uh, I think the the extortion mask actually might be better than Hearn's Antlers if I can get down to almost no money. Or no money. So. Um, it's just. Oh, we can't. We don't have the money for that. So, I mean, quite frankly, uh, if we're going to use that, we don't need this. I, I realize I'm gaining money by doing this, but. Uh, it's with purpose. Okay, we still have, uh, yeah, Rat's Cleaver and stuff, too. Don't need the Ring of Hindsight. Don't need the Merchant Ring. You can hold on to Killing Streak. Uh, hold on to that as long as we can. Get rid of that. Hold on to Hearn's Antlers, I guess, in case I change my mind for some dumb reason. Alrighty. And now, since this will be the last thing we're selling, we'll sell that as well. Buy 
as much food as we can. Okay. Now we hop back here. We are at zero money. Let's put on the extortion mask. It's not the mask, so there it is. Extort mask of extortion. Bump. Pass it by. Boing. Boing. Pass it by. Boing. Boing. Alrighty, full health. Nope. Okay, so we have a rat cleaver to help take care of the rats. Uh, Hearns Lint Lizard help with the lizards, but I think the extortion mask will also help more because it'll give us a boost to every attacking everything. Uh, and we have two uses of the uh, return your health to what it was at the start, which is full health. So as long as I keep pay attention to my health and have a moment to use that, we have two full heals. And I therefore... I better fucking win this one. Here we go. Our final confrontation begins. Alrighty. Will not fall as as the the dusty ones. Space. Full attacks. For me, thank you. Front row boom, back row boom. And then we play Zelda, as I say every time. Fortitude's breath. Do it for you. Thank you. Smack, 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 smack. He draws a line again. We fight the skeleton. The skeletons must be destroyed in terms of jack and or totem first. Okay, now I need to be patient and mindful, because it's rats. I'll go rushing in, let them come to me. that on his own. He's pouncy. I'm gonna smack you. I'm gonna go ahead and use one of these. Alrighty, 
explosions. Then we have ley lines that go to uh, counterclockwise. And then we'll have more explosions except for the back in the middle. And then we'll go clockwise. And then we'll fight the lizards in which we kill the king, kill the totem, kill the queen, and jack. And then we'll have the final round. Hopefully. <laughs> Lovely final round. Uh... Of Zelda and ley lines, where the ley lines travel faster. Right, right, ley lines on the other direction. I'm like, wait, what the fuck is he doing? What is it? Did I forget about the second ley lines? We still have one use of time heals. We are indeed massively, insanely powerful thanks to the uh, mask of extortion. I am feeling pretty good, and by saying that, I have doomed myself. I'm not even sure if me hitting him is actually mandatory or necessary or anything like that. Okay. Hey, King. Oh, yep, 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 yep. Stunned, maybe? There's a couple of you. King is dead. Totem is dead. Queen, I believe, is dead. Jack is dead. Explosion hit me. that are going to travel quickly in the clockwise direction. This is what killed me last time. They were just traveling faster than I anticipated. Yeah. Final heal, because I saw what was going on uh, uh, with my health. <laughs> I presume this is going to be clockwise ley lines. Not sure what's going on now. Is it gonna be another explosion and more fun? Nope, we're doing the thing. Oh, no, I will not go. It cannot end like this. Bye. Achievement unlocked. Dungeon master. I killed him. Finally. did it. I sent him into the pit. Where presumably it burns! And I just need to find Zelda and Ring a Gong. <laughs> there we go. We fucking did it, finally. Ah. Uh... I, I music. Gonna have to look. Going to have to look at this song. Going to have to look this song up later. Oh, how do I feel? I'd feel more accomplished if uh, the deck weren't stacked in my favor. But such is the way of roguelikes. <laughs> you know, basically, I did the thing where I you know kept bashing my head against it until I got a good run in Isaac. But like Isaac, even a good run can be destroyed easily, like it almost was, uh, until I use that final uh, full heal. This is an awesome song, I feel like. It's definitely gonna have to look it up. I mean, it does feel like a bit of a weight has been lifted at least, because now I can play something else. Downside is not knowing exactly what I wanna play quite yet. <laughs> if I want to commit immediately 
Two Hand of Fate 2. Uh, if I want to pick up a Metroidvania. If I want to play more of a farming sim, like I, as I've been kind of getting a small itch for. Although the one in mind isn't necessarily actually farming. Uh, or if I want to play a beat em up for a little while. So many options is the problem. Hey, it's me, even though it's not. I had nothing to do with this game. <laughs> that was the name Damien just, just went by. <laughs> I'm pretty certain that wasn't me. Even though I know, I, I actually know for certain it wasn't. Because even though, uh. Even though I have certainly backed games. Uh, and we will eventually be playing one of them, I know. It's just not out yet. <laughs> Technically two. Two or three. They're just not out yet. I, I, I would have to actually look up how many games I've backed. <laughs> now, that, now that I'm thinking about it, I'm like, yeah, I don't know, because I, I generally plan to play on stream every game I've backed when it eventually comes out. Oh, But regardless, when I... Uh, I don't just put in Damien. When I put in what name do you want in our in our credits or whatever, I don't put in just Damien. I don't put in Damien Fox either. I put in the full name of Damien, Damien Fiorello. I'm pretty certain looking through the achievements, there was not an achievement for sitting through the entire uh, credits, but I'm doing it anyway because song. And if I, <laughs> as soon as I stop going through all, hey, there's me and. As soon as I finish going through all of this, uh, I'm gonna have to make a decision, you know? <laughs> and I still don't have that decision figured out. Because all three would be fun things to play. The beat em up would most likely take the, the least amount of time in general before the next game. Uh, Metro Rainy would be par for the course of sorts. I killed you! The hell are you doing here, man? You're done. You're defeated. I won. At least you're quiet. But there we go. Complete defeated. I want to. I want to go against the goblet. Uh, I appreciate you being quiet. Let me go to the minion now. <laughs> True. Yeah. Uh, and, you know, this, basically, this now puts this game into the position of I can just kind of play it whenever I want uh, to finish at least unlocking things for myself. But it's also not really not massively worthwhile, considering the things I have to unlock. It's like, hey, succeed at a single victory um, things like five times, collect 150 gold, and then go to the space. Uh, grab th at least two or three helmets, probably three, and then go to the space. Uh, you know, et cetera, et cetera, to get the last tokens and stuff. So it's like, I don't know if that's actually worthwhile to me. 